Hello from Bulgaria once again. So I've got another package uh, that arrived. Uh, this one's from uh, Germany. The last Voyage 200 was a, I guess maybe a bit of a bust. It was 20 bucks, whatever. And I really, really tried uh, to to get the LCD fixed up, but I just was not able to. The rest of the calculator, calculator was just absolutely in mint condition. Everything was just mint. But the um, LCD connector just was not seated properly, you know, just something happened. They're really cheaply made. That one little little piece of otherwise amazing engineering is really poorly designed. It almost seemed like somebody tried to fix it uh, before. I just couldn't. I ran some, um, uh, just run the soldering iron just nice and warm along the connector. And you could see, you know, a few changes on the LCD. I actually ended up keeping the batteries in just to see if there's anything changing and it would change just for a little bit and then I would just revert change for I just gave up I mean the connectors are just like mosquito leg uh, sized and I just 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 couldn't do it so let's see what happened uh, with this package uh, let's get it opened up so just arrived today it was another eBay purchase uh, I guess around another, around another 20 bucks uh, 20 bucks or so I paid for this this one just had a few more things uh, included. It looks like the guy even included the CD. Whoa, that's kind of cool, hey? How retro is this? We don't even have a CD reader in this house, but we'll play around with this. Um, and we finally have the link cable, which I've never seen before. This, uh, according to my Discord pals, uh, converts a USB signal to, uh, it's like a serial connection to, um, headphone um, uh, connector on the back of the of the calculator so you can transfer transfer data uh, between your PC and the calc itself so you can transfer programs and apps I have no idea I've never used this before so maybe that's next video so whoa look at this whoa we're gonna keep these for later how oh, amazing we'll get a little book perfectly packaged and, um, you know, I'm not sure how, how this is utilized in this whole uh, scheme of things. So the, the guy promised me that this particular, that this one actually comes with the, with the cover for it. The previous one did not. Wow, look at this. Are you ready? He promised it to be brand new. Brand new. Focus on that. Brand new. It's brand new. It is brand new. It still has the, the plastic on it. So let's keep those um, Duracells at bay for now. I'm going to grab some Ikeas. One moment, please. <laughs> I can't believe this. That's crazy. I thought when he said when he said new, then it would just be kind of new. But so we're gonna do a bit of a a bit of a balance here with these EBL batteries and uh, these guys. This is just uh, temporary here. So one moment. Battery, just everything is absolutely mint condition. Are you guys ready? Check this out. Ooh, whoa, literally brand new. That's crazy. Ah, ah, ha, ha, look at this. Okay, here we go. Well, we have to wait for the next video. Hello, and welcome to the second part of the previous part. Uh, what I've done actually is I took the batteries out, reseated them, put them back in, and uh, here it is. Brand new. Never used Voyage 200. With all the bits and pieces, uh, what more can you ask for? Thank you for watching, guys.